What's going on, everybody? Thanks for tuning in. My name is Chase. Today's episode, we talk about the Heathen Pickups Valkyrie set. Now, I have the Valkyrie set installed on my Deviant Reaper. Now, this is from the first production run from Deviant Guitars. So, I think going forward, this will be the guitar that I use for all of my testing of pickups and things of that nature, uh, at least with the Heathen Pickups. This is gonna be a fun pickup test. Um, I'm gonna be doing a couple of videos because, uh, so, all right, let's just go ahead and talk about it. The Valkyrie set and the Draugr set are basically identical, all right? So we have the Draugr set still installed in my Deviant Grimoire, and the Valkyrie set is currently installed in the Reaper, and between the two, I do lean, or lean towards the Valkyrie set. Uh, as you can see, I'm gonna get a close up here if I can. You can see it in the neck pickup. We have the finished artwork installed. Um, the bridge doesn't really want to cooperate with me, uh, but nevertheless, you can see it there in the neck pickup. Uh, of course, as you can also see, we have the double Allen hex screws installed, and the bridge pickup is also an Onico five. So we have an Onico five and an Alnico 5 uh, for both pickups. Whereas with the Draugr set, we have the double uh, slugs, and we also have a ceramic in the bridge. Now, that's the only differences, the pole pieces and the magnet in the bridge pickup. Everything about the two pickup sets are the same. The winds, uh, the DC output is roughly the same. Um, I don't remember off the top of my head what these are, but in the next video I do, we are going to do an extensive shootout, uh, much like we did with the Draugr. So we'll do clean, crunch, heavy, high gain. Uh, we'll do the neck and the bridge. So in this video, it's more or less just a sound check, just to kind of get a feel for how these sound with your standard, you know, kind of dad rock sound, because that's the kind of vibe these really put off to me. Uh, so we're going to get everything set up, and then we'll uh, get some tones going. All right, so let's talk about the... Um, the rig rundown, all right? So we're gonna be taking the Reaper. We're gonna run that into my uh, Steve Stevens Clon pedal. Uh, you can see over here, the EQ is flat, right? Uh, the gain is at about two o'clock and the volume is at about one o'clock. That's my preferred standard for that pedal. I'm gonna run this into uh, the Friedman because I think the two of those have a great sound together. And to me, it really shows the pickups the best. Um, I got it dialed in pretty good, I think. And that's kind of what we're going to go with. Some sirens going off outside. And you guys hear that? Maybe? I don't know. Uh, so anyways, um, of course, so the guitar into the Rockaway Archer. That goes into the Friedman Runt 50. Now, my Runt does have the Mod uh, 2 or the Evo Hot Mod V2 installed. All that goes into my Mojo Tone ISO cab. That has a Jensen Raptor 100 and the Nighthawk 75. Of course, we have two Shure SM57s. You guys are getting the unprocessed audio, and hopefully it comes out all right. Let's go.
There you go, ladies and gentlemen, that is a Valkyrie pickup set. And that's just a quick sound check using the Freedman. Like I said, the next time we see these pickups, we are gonna do an extensive in-depth dive uh, just to see how well these can perform under a clean, a crunch, and a high gain. Uh, I really enjoy these pickups a lot, but I'm also going to be doing uh, a couple of different things with an Alnico 4 magnet and an Alnico 8 magnet. We're also going to be putting these into the Draugr pickup set. Of course, I want to see how well they perform uh, using different magnets. Uh, you know, sometimes just changing a magnet can improve or give better or worse results. So that's also something we're gonna be doing uh, in the future. Um, we'll try it in both the neck and the bridge. We're gonna start mostly with the bridge pickup. A lot of people tend to kind of stick on the bridge. So that's the one we're gonna focus on first, but make sure you give Royce a follow over at Deviant Guitars and Heathen Pickups to stay up to date on all the stuff. He's got a couple of other ones coming out. Uh, there's a Jotner and, um, what was it, the Fenrir, and I don't know what the other one's called. Uh, so, make sure you stay tuned. I don't know what all else he's going to have uh, for us to check out, but like I said, we got a lot of stuff planned for this Valkyrie set before we do anything. So, stay tuned and tell me in the comments below what you guys thought, and I'll see you in the next one.